almost a month into a, a two month spell. How, how are you enjoying it so far? Yeah, I think it's gone alright. Yeah. It's, um, it's been a difficult few games, as you know, and that, but obviously we're looking to turn it around as soon as possible. Yeah, obviously coming in under one manager and having a, a new one come through when yeah. you're a lone player must be must be a sort of strange sort of circumstance around a club. Yeah, it's a bit of a difficult scenario to be in, but um, I mean, I think we've all adapted well, you know, to the new manager, you know, ways and different methods and such. We've been on the training ground, you know, putting the hard work in and getting used to his ways, so it's been alright. Slightly unfamiliar role for you, is it on the right hand side or when you when you come to A little bit. I mean, uh, for me, I've been all over really, so I've just had to, uh, you know, learn to adapt to, to it and just wherever the guy wants to put me really. Yeah, that, that's your strength, isn't it? Sort of getting forward from midfield and I suppose mm. from the right you've got more license to do that than, than, than from the centre. A the, bit more, yeah. In the way that I mean, um, of course I do like to get forward as well, yeah, but on the right I've still got a job to defend as well, so I have to get up and down as much as I can. It disappointed you weren't able to open your account last week? It was, yeah, it, I was, yeah. <laughs> Uh, to talk yeah. us through that, obviously one good chance and then <laughs> the keeper saved and it came back. Yeah, I, mean, I thought I should have, yeah, if I'm and um, wait for them to be fair, but, uh, you know, it's just the way it's going at the moment. I mean, a bit more confidence in front of the goal and everyone will you know, be putting them away. Yeah, um, obviously if you get into that position again, you, you, finishing is a good part of your game. You had a really good goal scoring record at South End, didn't you? Yeah, I did, yeah. Um, hopefully I can just bring it back. I mean, I, you know, I'll be tra practicing on the training ground and that, putting um, finishes away and stuff, so... Hopefully it'll be alright. Obviously, you mentioned the defensive side. That's obviously something that the manager's been really keen to sort of pick up on since he's, since he's come here, doing yeah. your work, tracking back, and both <laughs> you and Rafa are almost playing almost as supplementary fullbacks at a stage last weekend. That, that's obviously something that, that that impresses, given that you're sort of a lone player that you bought into that kind of hard work. Yeah, definitely. I mean, uh, I have to really. I mean, if you want to be playing and that, you have to do both sides of the game. You have to do your defensive duties as well. And as the manager said, you know, he likes to build on. Um, a clean sheet, so you know, as long as we're keeping out at the other end, we've only got to score one goal to win. Yeah, um, looking ahead to Portsmouth, uh, obviously a big team in, in, in League Two, going to be a big yeah. crowd. Uh, an occasion you're looking forward to playing? Yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, all the players they all look forward to the, the I mean, they're all big games at the moment, but yeah, as you say, Portsmouth a big club, so um, yeah, hopefully a big crowd. You know, it's a big game, you do need to get a win rather sooner than later, so yeah, hopefully we can do that. Yeah, and a month to go on your loan spell. What, what are you hoping to to now achieve here? Is it is it looking to sort of impress enough to to extend that to the end of the season, or or are, are you are you sort of, sort of effectively in the shop window? I mean, I'm not sure myself. I mean, obviously, I just want to play as much as I can and try, you know, help Cheltenham get back up the league and whatnot. But in terms of you know my own future, nobody knows yet. Football things can turn around very quickly. Have you been in contact with Peter since you've been here with with people like Darren Ferguson and? And so no, I'm not the manager stuff. No, a few of the boys and I've been chatting to them about their results and stuff. But um, yeah, we'll just have to see how it goes. Yeah, and, and before you came here, did you speak to Grant McCann much about Chelsea? Yeah, I did. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he was telling me, yeah, nice town, nice people, and so far he's been right. So.